What's up, guys? It's Seb. I'm back. I know it's been like a week or longer than a week, but uh, don't freak out. That's a good thing. Um, haven't had much to update with y'all with, so haven't had much of a video to make. Uh, but it's about time. I just update y'all. Um, everything's still going good. Um, I still got, you know, showing 0% blast. It's, it's all okay. Like, my, uh, I, I'm, I'm fine. It's really just every day is the same. Uh, it's a whole lot of playing video games, sleeping, and just waiting around each day. Just let it all blend together. Uh, it sucks ass. It sucks ass, but, uh, yeah, there's that, um, that's, like, the gist of everything that I have for y'all, uh, so you can go ahead and end the video right now, but, um, no, I'm kidding, don't do that, please continue watching, um, basically, I do have one thing I can share i kind of figured this out uh like a few days ago um i've been here eight weeks this coming monday so that's a long ass time but i'm looking at spending at least 17 weeks in here without going home, like 17 weeks total straight in here. Uh, why or how, you might ask? Um, well, basically, let's start with when I get my bone marrow biopsy. How about that? Let's start with there. Uh, wouldn't happen in week eight. Uh, it's possible at the end of week 9 I get it, but probably week 10 I'm gonna get my bone marrow biopsy done. So let's say week 10 I get my bone marrow biopsy done, then give it three, 3 or so days to give me the full results back. Uh, that would put me in week 10 still probably, uh, and then week 11... Hopefully, if everything goes good with my bone marrow biopsy and I'm in remission and everything, hopefully that uh, during week 11, probably about midweek, I start uh, my chemo pre-transplant because they hit you with a week of chemo. So let's say week 11, I hit, I get hit with the nuclear chemo and that goes into week 12 and then the transplant day so it would be six weeks after either week 12 or week 13 i'm not really sure where i did the math there but about 17 weeks i know i did when i did the math like earlier that's what that, that was the number i got so could be wrong could be like 16 weeks could be like 18 weeks i don't know uh but around 17 weeks i would be in there because the six weeks following the transplant day that's like the minimum i could spend in here so i could be in here four weeks post uh, transplant day or I could be in here for 8 weeks 10 weeks, 12 weeks who knows, it's whenever I engraft and my counts recover, which my counts have not been recovering for months now so I don't know how long it's going to take for my counts to recover actually thinking about it, I feel like it's going to take a long ass time, which blows but uh, yeah that's about everything I have to share. Uh, it's just that I'm probably going to be spending like 16 to 20 weeks in this hospital straight. 
that lip that puts me about January, February, I get out of here. Which is crazy that I'm gonna be here that long. I was admitted here in September. It is now November and we are pushing me being here into the new year. Now don't get me wrong, I want everything to go perfect. I want everything to go right. And if that means that I have to stay in the hospital until February, then I'll stay in a hospital until February because that means that I'm leaving cancer free. So that's exactly what I want. So it sounds crazy, but I want to stay here for 17, 20 weeks, whatever. That's, that's what I want. So, and if everything doesn't go according, I'll be spending even longer in here. So it's actually the quickest way out is everything goes great and it'll be uh, like mid-January probably I get out. So it's crazy shit, but uh, that's what it's looking like. So uh, just something else. Y'all go support deadheaven.co. Got the champion sweatshirt on. Uh, and shout out Ash Pizza for the dope beanie. Got his stuff on it. Uh, gonna wear the hell out of this. This and the Psych World beanie I just got. Uh, hasn't shipped yet. Psych World's taking their time, but that's okay. I understand. I run a store and I know it can take a shitload of time to get clothes out but uh um yeah uh that's all i really have for y'all that's my update um like i said everything's just been going uh they ask how they ask me every day how it's going and then my response is it's going because that's just what it is so um yeah that's all so I hope y'all enjoyed and that this updated enough, um, updated y'all enough, uh, to give y'all, like, the information that some of y'all have been asking about, um, I just want to real quick say that I really appreciate all the positive comments and all the likes and views and the subscribers, uh, I really appreciate the attention I've received uh, making these, uh, because at the end of the day, I did make these to help people, and the more that see these, then the more people I have the opportunity to help get through their shitty situations, so, um, that's it again, but, um, just wanted to thank y'all real quick, so, peace.